All right, staying in southern Utah, heavy rain at Zion National Park earlier today. The National Weather Service saying that flash floods are expected, and rangers have already reported flooding in Zion Canyon. Yeah, Liv Kelleher is in Springdale for us, speaking with hikers about how this weather might be impacting their visiting plans. Yeah, it has been a pretty wild day of weather here in southern Utah. As you can see, it's raining right now. It's raining pretty hard. There's some rain on the lens, as I'm sure you can tell. We've had some thunder and some lightning in the last few minutes. I started the day in St. George where we got over an inch of rain from overnight thunderstorms. That same storm line moved east here to Springdale and Zion National Park. People in the area received an emergency alert to their phones warning them of flash floods. Popular hiking destinations like the Narrows have been closed due to this risk. Scott Nassen, who has visited Zion eight times, says the rain gives him the opportunity to experience the park in a new way. He says even with his hiking experience, he always heeds the warnings of the park rangers. We always listen to what the rangers are saying, especially if we're going to go up into the Narrows because it's so unpredictable and we don't come out here enough to really know it like they know it. So if they tell us to stay away, we stay away and we'll choose to do some other hikes other than ones that are going to be potentially dangerous. The National Park says that flash floods are expected and there is a flood watch in effect through most of southern Utah through the end of the evening. It's best to stay out of those slot canyons until that flood watch is lifted. In Springdale, Liv Kelleher, KUTV 2 News.